Hey what is up guys my name is Eric and welcome to a real quick Team Fortress 2 tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install custom HUDs in Team Fortress 2. First things first you're going to need to find yourself a HUD that you like. I recommend looking on HUDs.tf, link will be in the description for this website. I'll be using the Zephyr HUD for the purpose of this tutorial. This is the same uh, HUD that I use myself. So once you find yourself a HUD that you like, simply press and download. Open with WinRAR or 7-zip, wait for it to download and once it's downloaded, open the zip file up and navigate your way to this specific directory. It might be a bit different for you, um, assuming that you installed the game on the C drive, but whichever drive you install it on, the directory should be quite similar. So it's on the program files x86, folder, steam, steam apps, common, team folders 2, tf and from here find the custom folder. If you don't have the custom folder, you can simply create one by right clicking on the side here, new folder and naming custom or lowercase. Open it up. As you can see, I've already installed the Zephyr hard mod or Zephyr hard before, but I'm going to be overriding it for the purpose of this tutorial. So open up the zip file once again and tr simply drag and drop the folder into the custom uh, folder there. Uh, it will go through the process of transferring all the files over into the folder there. Um, for me, it will ask to replace the files because I already have the HUD installed before. So I'm going to replace the files in the destination, but this shouldn't come up for you, assuming that you don't have the same exact uh, HUD before. And that's literally it. Now you have a HUD installed. Uh, let's test it out in game. And as you can see, once the game has loaded up, everything is different from the regular um, HUD that TF2 ships with. Um, depending on which HUD you get, um, obviously it's going to look different from this one, unless you get the same exact HUD. Uh, but yeah, that's it for today's tutorial. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully it was helpful. If it was, please click that like button down below as it helps me out a lot. If you have any questions, sorts of questions for the future videos or whatever, then leave those in the comment section down below. As always, don't forget to subscribe.